Hey everybody, all these particle effects have something in common. They all have the same cumbersome scene tree, with a Particles 2D node and a timer, the timer being set to the same as the lifetime of the Particles 2D, and then connected to its timer timeout signal, where I queue it free. But now, on Godot's asset library, we have the Particles 2D Plus node by ACB Games. This node has a particle cycle finish signal, eliminating the need for a timer. It also comes with the one-shot start property, which allows you to edit the particle in the editor without needing to turn emitting off. To add this node to your game, simply go to Create New Node in Godot and search Particles. You can add the Particles 2D Plus directly, but I would recommend you use the regular Particles 2D, and you'll see why in a second. Now, save the scene and create a new script. Then we'll just change the script so it extends the Particle 2D Plus class rather than the Particles 2D class. Then we'll navigate over to the Node tab and connect the Particle Cycle Finish signal. Here's where I'd usually cue the particle free, but I'm just going to put print finish for demonstrative purposes. Then I'll head over to the inspector tab and turn one shot start on. You can see that my particle is emitting in the editor, but when I run it, it emits once and then stops. You can also see that finish has been printed out in the output. Hey everybody, thanks so much for watching. I hope you found this video useful, and if you did, please drop a like below and potentially subscribe to my channel. Also, maybe check out one of these two videos, you know, whatever floats your boat. So thanks so much for watching and have a great day.